Really? Yeah. Yeah, before we move on to the football, I was at a workshop last week uh, put on by the LSC Foundation and the Manchester United Foundation that was educating school kids from Liverpool and from Manchester about the impact tragedy chanting can have. How important do you feel that work is and, and what's your message to any supporter who still thinks that those kind of chants are acceptable? Yeah, I think it's it's super important. Um, so there are different aspects. Um, that one is that I don't hear it. Honestly, when I'm on the sideline, it's like I heard after the game that it happened, and that's obviously not great. Um, but I think it's in, in general it's just helpful that we educate our kids in, 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 in specific things, um, respect, understanding, all these kind of things. And. I just see it that way, the two of the biggest football clubs in the world, um, let's just show a bit of class in these moments. So don't do that, so don't sing this or sing that, just show class, have a fight on the pitch, let's play football, let's, if you want, be happy if we lose or whatever, these kind of things, that's all fine, but besides that, just show a bit of class, that would be really uh, my wish for all of us. In terms of the title race now, do you feel to win the title you have to be perfect in terms of results between now and That's obviously how it is in the Premier League. So to tell me a different race, yeah, but we became champion and it was obviously decided pretty early, otherwise probably City as well, here or there. Um, but most of the time we're tight races and it looks like a tight race. Yeah. And so if it's a tight race, then the best place you can be is in it. And we are in it, so that's cool, that's good. Um, you know, let's keep fighting. That's that's how it is. So, and obviously the next one is a big one, um, and like they all are, um, we have so we have to be. be I, the, I, I I watched it. I was schedule and because somebody told me we somebody said we had the the, the, the best fixture list or schedule. I looked at it. And I, said, I really don't know how you can have that idea. So maybe I'm too negative, but it's really it's a tough one. Um, good opponents, and but we are ready. We are ready and. Um, we want to be in that fight, and so let's see what we can make of it. Any more? Yeah, Betty Lover for PLP. Um, Jürgen, last time out at Old Trafford was pretty memorable. Thanks for rem oh. reminding me. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Um, what did you learn from that? That the 10th interview is not as good as the 9th you give after the game. <laughs> um, and. Hmm. Yeah, so the game the story of the game, we spoke probably after the game about it, so they started better than we took over and we were really good that day. We didn't finish the situations often in extra time and that's a good news. We will not have, as far as I know, at least not twice 30, uh, 15 minutes um, extra time. So um, that means that was too much for us that day. We couldn't control it then anymore, made mistakes we didn't make before at all. Um, and United turned the game around, so United is just the top side playing at home, we all know that, but we have to, can I just tell, let's do what we did up from minute 15 to, I don't know, 70 something, football is not that easy, so we have to to find a way to cause United problems and they will try exactly the same um, on that level with this opponent in the stadium, yeah, we have, we better play a really good football game, to be honest, um, if we want something there. Are you personally going to miss these big games against uh, Manchester United? No, I had them often enough, but now that's not about that. I understand that, but what a manager would I be if I would say I miss the Manchester United games or the City games or the, and all the others? I don't miss. Nah, um, it's it's all fine. My, um, I will miss probably all of them, but how I said, so far in my life I missed all the rest. So we'll we'll see how I deal with missing football. Any more? No? Thank you very much. Everybody wants to go home. <laughs> <laughs>